Ah, Cordelius. What can I say that hasn't been said already? So, everyone knows that Cordelius is very broken, he's super, it is very annoying and powerful, and the hypercharge, it is not an easy thing to deal with. So today, in opposition to what happened last time I did this type of video, I have suggested a lot of tiny nerfs that Cordelius just simply needs. Because Cordelius is not just mad broken in one certain area, he is just a very strong character in a lot of areas. So today, I'm gonna nerf Cordelius and I hope you enjoy. So I want to start with something that just deeply annoys me, which is the hypercharge. Why is the Cordelius a hypercharge, probably one of the most complex brawlers to ever exist in Brawl Stars, so freaking simple? I just hate the hypercharge. For me, it feels like a simply brain dead hypercharge. Not funny at all. So first thing I want to do it is to kind of rework the effect of the hypercharge. Instead of people, the enemy team, n being slowed during the shadow realm, now any enemy team that would be on the shadow realm, they instead would not be able to reload any ammo. So during the 8 seconds that you would be on the shadow realm, you would not be able to reload a single ammo. These would counter especially characters like Carl, B and Bonnie. Honestly, I don't even know how would you do this to Carl, but regardless, you would not be able to reload your ammo. Which, it would still be very broken, but saying that you can slow people on the Dark Realm, it just feels kind of overkill as well. I mean, not that this new version of Hypercharge wouldn't be overkill as well, but it feels different, because you gotta understand, Cordelius is already fast in the Shadow Realm. Cordelius has the speed boost of the Hypercharge, and people in the Shadow Realm get slowed. What the hell? So I hope that this reward to the Hypercharge, it kinda makes some justice to his legendary status. Next thing I want to talk about it is his star powers and gadgets, because Cordelius has one thing that most brawlers don't, which is the extreme versatility and how easy it is just to pick the gadget or star power, because Cordelius both star powers and gadgets are equally solid, so you can actually be extremely versatile on how you want to play Cordelius. And let's start with his first star power, Combo Shroom. So I want the bonus damage being reduced from 30% to 25%. A very small nerf, because on one hand it is kinda hard to hit both projectiles to the same person because they are very thin, it is very hard to hit both in the same person. But if you know how to play the game, if you are a skilled player, it is something kinda easy to do and the benefit it's just massive. Just getting that plus 30% damage, it is a lot, and the 25% would be a very tiny nerf, but I feel like it would just calm down Cordelius in higher levels. And now, let's talk about the other star power, the Mushroom Kingdom. <laughs> I love that reference. So, it's just a very simple nerf, but it would be very effective as well. I want the healing of the mushrooms to not happen when you're out of the Shadow Realm. So, as soon as you go out of the Shadow Realm, you cannot have the healing effect or the poison. Because the mushroom effect, it is over time, it is over 3 seconds, if I am correct. And you can bring that effect to the normal realm, kinda, and you would just be very, very strong and it would be kinda unfair to the enemy team which I feel like that should not be the case, Cordelius should be stronger on the Shadow Realm. And this nerf would kinda fix that broken thing about his second star power. Now let's talk about his gadgets. Now I would nerf his first gadget as well, but there is literally no way I could actually nerf that and I feel like making the jump smaller it is not if e not even fix the gadget so first gadget nerf out of the window because it's it's not possible so let's talk about I would say the most annoying one his second gadget the poisonous mushroom and this one not only it feels wrong the name has the mechanic itself it's just broken Number one, poisonous mushroom is silence really poison? It just for me does not feel right. And on top of that, one second of silence in one gadget? 
on Cordelius, it just changes so many things. Out of nowhere, it feels like you're about to kill Cordelius, but psych, he just pulls out the poisonous mushroom and you just die. It, it, it is very, a very unbalanced gadget. So I, I don't think there is any other way without a complete rework. So now, the mushroom that you throw, instead of applying one second of silence, it would actually apply poison for three seconds. And during that poison duration, your healing would be reduced by 40%, kinda how crow's knife would work. And the idea is that the mushroom would deal the same damage on impact, but the poison would deal the equivalent of two mushrooms of damage. So your next attack with the gadget, it would technically deal the damage of three mushrooms on one mushroom, but a third of that damage would be instantaneous and the other two thirds would be over three seconds. I feel like it would still be a very strong gadget overall, especially because the anti-heal, but now I feel like the gadget is doing some justice to its own name. And the silence by itself, it's just a very broken mechanic. And I mean, I also think that reducing the silence duration to half a second, it would not be a good choice. So I am very confident that this rework, it is the best way to do it. And finally, to end this nerf list to only Cordelius, his super duration would be reduced from 8 seconds down to 6 seconds. So even though this is overall a pretty substantial nerf, remember that there can be some scenarios where the Dark Realm lasting or less could be more beneficial for you. Some very rare scenarios, but that is not enough to make it up for such a nerf. So actually, to fix this, I would create a new mythic gear for Cordelius, which would be called Never Ending Darkness, which would increase the duration of his super back to 8 seconds. Another thing that I always interesting about Cordelius is that pretty much all of the gears, except the, the health one and the vision, I mean, don't use those, all of the rest are actually pretty good on Cordelius. I mean, he's just very versatile, again. And with this new mythic gear, you now have to do the choice of sec kinda sacrificing, if you feel like you need it, one of your gear slots to have your super lasting 8 seconds. Again, if you feel like you need, you can still just have the super lasting 6 seconds. But I definitely feel like the super lasting less, it is something that he needed, but I didn't want to just straight up kill his super, so with this mythic gear everything should be rebalanced. And there we have it, all of the nerfs and a couple reworks that I would do to Cordelius to finally make it balanced. Honestly, I would not be surprised if re Cordelius got some sort of rework, because he hasn't been nerfed in a long time and he's still a top 10 brawler, so I am suspecting that they are doing something behind the scenes. But this is just my opinion, what is yours? Write in the comments down below, trust me, I will read them, and I'll see you on the next video.